To present the Living Legend Award, we are extremely proud and happy to have with us last year's recipient of this award, Miss Barbara Mandrell. In the past year, after a long and painful recovery from an automobile accident, and after giving birth to her third child, Barbara has come on to achieve new goals in a legendary career with her triumphant return to television and live performances. Please welcome Miss Barbara Mandrell. Thank you so much. Roy, I promised I would not have been out here early, but Harold Reed told me you're on, so I always do, you know, when Harold says go. It is such a pleasure to be with all of you tonight. I get to present your Living Legend Award. I uh, am thrilled about this because this particular person means the world to me and to every other performer in country music. It's a very special award. It is given by the fans in recognition of contributions made to country music in a career spanning 25 years or more. The very first record tonight's winner cut was on an obscure label called Zero. Hardly the beginning that you would expect for a career that was to become the subject of a best-selling book and an Oscar-nominated movie. Here on tape are some memories of your living legend. Kentucky coal mining family. A few weeks short of her 14th birthday, she married Mooney Lynn, and she was the mother of four by the time she was 18. Loretta's music career didn't start until 10 years after marriage and motherhood. Hey, Loretta. It's so hard to get started and to succeed in this business, and I've always been proud of you. And I want to take this time to thank you for helping me with my career. And Loretta, you've always been a legend to me. And I'm so glad everybody else thinks so. I love you. Against all odds, her first record made the top ten and led to her debut on the Grand Ole Opry. Right now we have a very special treat for you. A little lady that I just recently met, and uh, I believe you're going to really enjoy her. So let's make her welcome right now, singing a song that she wrote herself. So from the hills of Kentucky, let's give a great big grand old Opry welcome to Miss Loretta Lynn. Night on, there was no stopping Loretta. Hey, the Wilman brothers, Teddy and Doyle, brought uh, Loretta into my office. And uh, not only did they bring me a, a wonderful recording artist, they brought me a, a lifelong friend uh, and uh, someone that I cared a lot about for many years. If anybody ever deserved to be a legend, you certainly do, Loretta. We love you. Successful as a solo artist, Loretta also teamed with duet partner Conway Twitty. Together they became the most awarded duo in country music history. When I was asked to say a few words about this lady, I took it very seriously. As I searched my mind, I thought, this is impossible. What can I possibly say that hasn't already been said? You know, I truly believe that God makes each and every one of us just a little bit special. 
But in a rare moment, he reaches into his bag of magic clay and creates someone very special. And that's how we got Loretta. Loretta, I know I'm speaking for everyone watching on television tonight, as, as well as all of us here in this building, when I say country music just would not be the same without you. God's little bit of magic clay. I'm proud to be your singing partner. And thank you for touching our lives. And I love you, Loretta. Loretta toured constantly, headlined in Las Vegas, hosted her own network television shows, and appeared on countless others. In her rise to stardom, Loretta brought a major change to the role of women in country music. She wrote and sang about controversial subjects in straightforward, often humorous lyrics. The girls in New York City, they all march for women's lips. get on to me all the time for when I was singing your songs back when I was a kid she'd say now Reba quit singing like Loretta and make your own style well I've been singing your songs for a long time because that's the kind of songs I like nowadays it's for women it's things that women probably can't say for themselves and you're doing it for them and I'm trying to do the best I can to do the same thing you did because I don't think there's anybody that will ever be able to fill your shoes you've worked the hardest and you love your fans and that always shows. We love you. Loretta Lynn is controversial because of her honesty. In the songs she writes and the songs she selects to sing. But when she went around Nashville to find the songs for the Just a Woman album that I worked on with her, uh, Nashville found out how honest she really was. Uh, she picked songs she liked. Country radio said maybe too much strings. But that's controversial. That's Loretta Lynn. That's what she felt at the moment. Loretta Lynn, you deserve being honored by this industry and by the women of this country. Congratulations. In her 25-year career, Loretta won countless major awards, including 25 Music City News Awards, and became known as one of the most admired and respected women in the world. Loretta Lynn is more than a great entertainer. She's been an inspiration to many of us. You know, Loretta, you dared to dream, and you made those dreams come true. And also, you've maintained a dignity and a warmth that's made you one of a kind. So on behalf of millions of people all over the world, I'd like to say congratulations, Loretta. And thanks for sharing your talent, your pride, and your dreams. written on the cue cards. This is from the bottom of my heart. I'm sure you know, I just want to say it out loud to you in front of everybody, as one of your fans, but also as one of your, your peers, your fellow country music performers. I love you so deeply for who you are, what you are, the person that you are. But I also thank you as a female for being, to my knowledge, the first woman in country music to be a great, big enough star, to be a headliner to have her own show and pave the way for all of us, even though it's just been a very short time, 
to pave the way for the other females like myself to have our own show and not be the token female country singer. You did it for all of us. Country music fans can take great pride in the contributions of our living legend, Miss Loretta Lynn. I think this is quite a surprise. I wasn't looking for this. I think probably since I've been singing that it, you people have done more for me than I have for you. And I love all of you. Thank you.